Alright guys, hey, how's it going? I'm actually recording this in a different setting right now since the setting over in my room is a little too congested and a little too junky right now. So I decided to film in a different setting and I decided to get out of my apartment because hey, it's a beautiful day outside and I thought why not. So I'm going to be on this stuff right here. And by the way, I'm not even entirely sure how this camera is picking it up. I did my best to try to make the focusing right, so I do apologize if there's something out of focus. But I'm going to be reviewing this today. This is the Pure Oils by Silk Elements Moisturizing Marmalade. This is what the lid itself looks like here. And you can find this at Sally Beauty. It's no longer Sally's Beauty Supply. It's called Sally Beauty. You can find this stuff over here for exactly $8.99 plus tax. If you have a beauty card, it can be significantly less. This is actually part of the recently new... Excuse me. This is part of the recently new line by Silk Elements, which is called Pure Oils by Silk Elements, as you can see. Most of their labels in this little line are designed to look like this. I believe in that line there's also a shampoo, a leave-in conditioner, and a mask, I think. And this stuff too. But I believe those are the other three products that are in this line as well. So I ended up picking this up because before I was using, I believe, the Diva Curl ultra defining gel at that point I was using that stuff but I was in a dire financial situation and I had to return that product because I needed some extra money so I still wanted to try out a nice styling gel for my afro here which is currently shrunken up because I don't feel like doing anything with it so I decided to get this stuff so I can style my hair as well as moisturizer and whatnot. I particularly am weary about using gels because sometimes they work and sometimes they don't work on my hair. And usually my hair and scalp will be the first to tell me if a product doesn't work, in case you didn't know. This is, I don't know if I'm gonna actually spill it, but this is pretty much what it looks like. Yeah, this is what it looks like right now. It has a pretty nice perfumey smell here, and to be honest, this gel is actually really good. The consistency is almost equivalent to, um, what was that thing called? The As I Am Curly Jelly. It's almost similar to that stuff, and I've tried the As I Am Curly Jelly before, but unfortunately, it did not work, and I had to get rid of it. But that was like a long time ago, and I don't even remember when. So, this stuff is really good. It has coconut oil coconut oil, shea butter, honey, and passion fruit oil in it, which are the four main ingredients in it. And ingredient list is pretty simple. I mean, it does have a few things in it. But in terms of styling, this stuff is very, very easy to spread throughout your hair. But what I recommend if you're going to use this stuff, I recommend doing like a makeshift lock method. And what I mean by that is first dampen your hair with some water and then apply your favorite hair moisturizer or hair lotion. Yeah, apply your favorite hair lotion or hair moisturizer or hair milk to your hair and then go ahead and apply a little bit of this. By the way, you don't need to apply a lot of this unless you have a lot of hair. I don't have a lot of hair on my head as you might see, so a little goes a long way. I just need like a little smidgen, enough to just cover my two little fingers here. And because of this, it definitely holds my kinks and coils and keeps them defined and it definitely holds my afro in style. So because of this, my afro rarely experiences shrinkage when I use this stuff. And also it doesn't dry my hair out. That's, this is the first, actually this would have to be the second gel since I've already mentioned Diva Curl. But this is the second gel I've used that does not dry my hair out. That was the biggest problem that, went, that I had with the As I Am Curling Jelly, and which is why I stopped using it because that stuff dried my hair out. This does not, and I think it's because of the shea butter and the honey in it, which happen to be two ingredients that my hair really likes. So, definitely does not dry your hair out, but because it does not dry your hair out, please do not expect this to be a moisturizer or replace your favorite moisturizer. Now, if your hair tolerates it, could just skip your favorite hair moisturizer and just dampen your hair and go ahead and apply this stuff or you can dampen your hair seal in the water with some oil and then go ahead and apply this this um styling gel to it could do that but make sure your hair tolerates it first otherwise 
do not expect this stuff to moisturize your hair completely. Yes, it's going to hold the style and it's definitely going to keep your curls, your kinks, and your coils very defined to where it doesn't matter how humid it is, it's not going to shrink. But it's not going to completely moisturize your hair if you understand what I'm talking about. It's not going to moisturize as well as a hair moisturizer, but it's definitely going but if you're looking for a good style that's going to keep us hold all day, this is the stuff I recommend for you. Sure, there are plenty of other stuff out there, but if you're looking for something that has a little more natural stuff in it, go ahead and try this stuff. This, and because you use a little bit at a time, I'm only like, think about right here. Yeah. I think I'm only about right here because I've been using this for a while now, I think for about maybe two months, and I don't even need a lot of it. Sometimes, and by the way, I don't use it every day. With this stuff, you don't need to use it every day because I notice with my hair, if I style my hair using this, the next day before I go out, all I have to do is dampen it, seal in the water with some oil, and just fluff it out and I'm ready to go. Now, if, if it calls for it, I might take a little, little dab of this and just apply it to certain areas that I want to be more defined. And sometimes it, sometimes it will work and then other times it's not necessary. So you can actually have second day hair by using this product. If your hair allows it or if your hair is capable of that. I am thinking about applying this stuff in combination with a, what's it called, a hair pick? A hair picking comb you know those little combs that you usually see stuck in afros excuse me I'm thinking about actually getting one of those and trying them out in combination with this stuff to see how it works I'm just thinking about it because I am really good at finger detangling and finger styling and whatnot because my fingers are the best tools for my hair right now but that's pretty much all I have to say about this stuff like I said you can find it at Sally Beauty for around $8.99 plus tax if you have a beauty card, it can be less. But this is actually part of the Pure Oils by Silk Elements collection. There's like four pieces in total of that collection. Actually, no, I take that back. Because then you got the oils. And I forgot how many oils are actually in that collection. Yeah, I completely forgot. But there's actually five pieces in that collection. There might be more because of the oils. But give this stuff a try. You might like it. and. I say it's a much cheaper alternative than going for Diva Curl because Diva Curl is particularly very expensive. I mean, the gel was like 20 bucks, bucks, which is insane, but that's for a different topic. So if you've tried this product before, let me know how it worked for you in the comments below. And when you do, mention your hair type because I'm actually interested to see how well it works for other hair types besides my type of hair. Want to see how well it works for curly, even wavy. but. If you haven't, if you've tried it before, let me know how it worked for you in the comments below and be sure to mention your hair type too. If you like my review, be sure to check out my blog, be sure to leave a thumbs up and go ahead and share it if you wish. But there's also a blog post on it, be sure to check that out too and if you're interested, go ahead and follow my blog. Now, like I said in the previous video, I'm doing as best as I can to get these reviews out because I just got hired like two days ago for my job. so. I'm going to be working now, and it's going to be a little bit harder for me to get these product reviews out. Shouldn't really be that difficult since I'm probably going to be only working 20 hours a week anyway, but you get the idea. So I'm going to try my best to get these reviews out to you, and I will see you in the next video. So for now, I have exactly an hour to get ready because I have to go, make some, go do some errands. So I will see you in the next video, guys, alright? See you later, everyone. Take it easy.